Hi, I'm Nicole, and welcome back to Produce Made Simple. As much as we love fresh fruits and vegetables, we hate food waste. Can you believe that about 60% of the food produced in Canada is wasted every year, and about 32% of that could be consumed? It's spring, so it's Ontario asparagus season, and we thought we would give you some tips and recipe ideas to help you make the most of your grocery dollars and avoid food waste at home. So when you get your asparagus home, make sure you store it in the correct way to help it last longer. The first way we'd recommend is to take a damp paper towel or a clean damp cloth and you wrap the ends up in it. Then keep it in a plastic bag in the fridge. The second way is to store it sort of like you see at the grocery store. You put it upright like if they're cut flowers with a little bit of water in the bottom of the cup and then you simply pop a plastic bag on top. Don't seal it. So to prepare asparagus efficiently, you don't want to waste too much of it. Don't hold it here to snap it, hold it just at the bottom. You only need to cut off about an inch off the end. So snap it here. Alternatively, you can just line them up and cut the end off with a knife. One of the best tips I can give you to help you avoid food waste at home is just to be thoughtful of the food that you've bought. Use the food in your fridge. Thankfully, asparagus is really versatile and there's so many ways to enjoy it. You can fry it, grill it, boil it, steam it, put it in a casserole, there's loads of different applications. You can even eat it raw, and all you need is a vegetable peeler to help prepare it. Please visit our website, producemadesimple.ca, for lots of these recipe ideas and even more tips. Thanks so much for joining. See you soon. Okay. Um, right. We're coming into Ontario asparagus season. Nope. With Ontario asparagus... <laughs> Cover that with a paper towel. Nope. Cover that with some plastic bag. Some plastic bag? <laughs> Use a vegetable peeler and... Uh, what? 